Today I'll be showing you guys my first few matches with my free to play Dragon Maid deck that I created. Looking back at these matches, you'll definitely see if you're an experienced player that I did make a few mistakes and I didn't go for the most optimal of plays, but that's what these videos are for. They're for essentially documenting my journey throughout becoming a better Dragon Maid player in Yu-Gi-Oh! Now these are all ranked matches, which means that every time you duel, you actually get to participate in a ranking system. You start off in bronze, then go into silver, then gold and platinum, and I don't know, king of games. I'm not 100% sure what's beyond platinum. By the time this video comes out, I'll probably know. However, as of right now, these are a few of my bronze matches. Tomorrow I'll be going over my silver matches, and let me tell you, uh, my silver matches were actually incredibly, incredibly fun, so keep an look out tomorrow when i started to play with dragon maids online and i started playing against other people i started to realize how incredibly strong dragon maids are they're by no means meta but they're what's considered to be rogue rogue is essentially a non-meta deck that can do well against meta decks if you have the right cards so think of today's video and today's loadout that i'm using as like a prepubescent rogue deck where i have some strong cards and i have the potential to grow but i just am in that awkward stage where none of it really makes sense and i'm just starting to make sense of the strategies it's the equivalent of me growing chest hair or my voice cracking or think of it as like a caterpillar about to sprout into a cocoon and then morph into a butterfly think of it kind of like that as of right now i'm in that cocoon phase just very awkward and just like very stiff and with that being said let me go ahead and get into the gameplay but before that i would like to Tell you guys about some of my thoughts about master duel after playing for oh so long as of right now the online matches are pretty great uh, you can find matches very easily and very fast however i would like to put in some input where i would like for master duels to add a few things in the future one i would love a game mode where you can play goat format for all the old school players to come back or to try out the game to be able to play the format that they all grew up playing like myself even though i'm one of those players that are is playing the game even in current format i would love to go back to good format use some of the most nostalgic cards in the game and just have fun with it really like i can't even bring up tribute summoning without somebody in the chat calling me a boomer it's embarrassing i would love to play one of these goat format game modes so i can see some of these kids absolutely start to lose it as soon as they realize they can't synchro exceed link summon a gajillion monsters also that they can summon like a measly little turd monster that just so happens to be a 12 star zero attack zero defense monster but it has an effect that can steal my house steal my girlfriend it can drain my white blood cell count and give me COVID-19 all in one effect all while also having another crazy effect that I can't kill this thing with any card in the game unless I hit the surrender button yeah that would be kind of fun to see the point is a goat format I think would be really fun for OG players and for newer players too it would also be really fun if you could actually use banned or forbidden cards in like a dual room like just toggle on toggle off banned or forbidden cards man that would be wild just let the community go crazy and make these outrageously broken decks that should be banned but don't let that touch the ranked matches and one more thing i actually wanted to actually mention a casual queue similarly to what ranked matches has you know how you have ranked matches uh you have dual rooms and then you have event duels well they should create a separate game mode just somewhere on that screen where it says casual queue where you can just match make with anybody that's just playing casually because i imagine there's a lot of people that just want to play a casual mode where they can try out specific decks and not have to play for stakes i know you can do that in dual room but being able to just go into matchmaking is very very nice i think dual room should be if you want to play against specific people and casual matches if you just want to play with anybody i think that would be really cool i'll be back tomorrow with a more optimized dragon maid video but other than that subscribe to the channel it's free also also like the video and comment on the video so it can help the algorithm and all that shenanigans. Help a casual Yu-Gi-Oh player, would you? Anyways, enjoy the matches. I think it's time to finally go online. I think it's time to finally get our first duel. I am going to be using... Uh, no, I'm not going to use this deck. This deck is poo poo stinky. The deck that I'm going to be using is Dragon Maids. And it's a free-to-play deck. And uh, try to get it as good as I can with the cards that I have and the knowledge that I have. So let's go ahead and take a look at uh, if we can get our first dub. Okay, starting hand, kind of, kind of sus. It's actually really, really bad. <laughs> okay, is that a blue eyes deck? Oh boy, here we go. 
Blue Eyes fanboys coming in hot. My God. Can you be any less original? Blue Eyes Abyss Dragon. All right. Sweet. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I'm going to set this card. I'm going to use Parlor. I'm going to go with Parlor. And I'm going to send... Um, I'm going to send the drag uh, chamber. Then I'm going to go with... Uh, I'll go ahead and I'll summon Striker. With Parlor. Just so I can get Spheres going. Then I'll get the Hospitality. So I can summon Chamber. Summon Chamber. And then when I summon Chamber, I'm going to go ahead and go with uh, Transform. Okay, beautiful. And then, trying to see what the best play is here. Go with a show. Face up. Just like that. Oh, man, that music really picked up, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, that music is popping off right now. I'm trying to see what the best thing to do here is. I don't know if I should summon spheres right now. So I'll be sacrificing show. I should just attack. Why not? Attack with this one too. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna activate Dragon Maid. And I'm gonna get Parlor. So I can get the Tithing down. You poor, poor, unfortunate soul. You poor, unfortunate soul, friend. <laughs> Resolve. Okay, first of all, I'm going to summon Chamber. Perfect. And I'm also summoning my big old dragon. Bam. I'm going to activate the effect of the chamber. <laughs> I'm going to get another change over. I'm sorry. No, no. I'm going to get a hus uh, hospitality. No, I should have gone uh, tithing. Shoot. That's okay. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. I'm going to just do welcome because lol. Then after that, I'm going to go and get a, a nice sphere going. Just like that. Perfect. The bush. Now this will really guarantee everything. Then I'm going to activate this. Just like that. Beautiful. Return that to the deck. Then I'm going to summon it. <laughs> then I'm going to get my house out. Get my house made for this big old dragon. Actually, no, 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 no. I'm going to do, yeah, housemaid for this. And for chamber. To summon my housemaid. <laughs> Bam. And then after that, just because I can. In case there's any traps or anything like that. <laughs> A bush. And then I will now attack. All right. Well, sayonara, amigo. And that's our first W. All right. Cool. We did it. He was probably like, like Pikachu shock face, like what the hell? Okay, so I got hospitality, I got dragon, and I got kitchen. Not too bad. I wish I had Maxi though. God dang it, dude. I want Maxi so bad. I want Maxi so bad, chat. I want to get the meme. I want to get my, my Twitch clip of Maxi. No, I have it. It's just I can't pull it. Oh, which one was this one again? Discard and summon one level. Oh my God, just, uh, yeah, go for it. Let's just start it off, bro. Pop off, queen. Why not just start making moves when it's not your turn? Because why the hell not? Because why the hell not? <laughs> it's 
It's not even my turn. Now it's my turn. <laughs> How does this work? Why does this work this way? All right, not an Octavision, so I'm not going to strike her. I got everything I need, too. I'm going to get this. I got no changeover, so I'm going to get the changeover right now. Uh, where's my shiny one? There you are. I want the shiny one because it looks good. Um, then I'm going to do welcome because lol. Then I'm going to change over. I'm going to go ahead and I'll get house out. Okay, beautiful. And here comes house. A bush. All right. And then after that, <laughs> here's what I'll do. You're going to say goodbye to that card that you have defending you. All right. That card is now useless to you. Bye bye. Oh, it's a oh another blue eyes deck. Are you kidding me right now? Holy crap, Ola! What is with these blue eyes decks, dude? Man, I'm gonna do this. Hospitality to summon my freaking big dragon, and I'm gonna send a send this to the graveyard. Then I'm going to go ahead and use this yet again to summon a show. My big dragon. And I still have a bounce, which is great. Just like that. And just for the lols, unless you have a hand trap, I'm going for game. Unless you have a hand trap, I'm going for game. So you better pray to Lord Ash, Lord Defect Valor, or any other hand trap, which that you don't have. And what do they say in Yu-Gi-Oh again? Oh yeah, back to Fortnite. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> All right, that was nice. Oh God, that's bad. But at least I'm going second. At least I'm going second. Oh my god, we're back to this. Link Karibo? What does that do? What goes around comes around, boss. Cool. Sounds good to me. I was really hoping that I would pull a Raigeki. Forty. All right, Maxi. Oh, thank God. Oh, and I got knocked as well. Okay, good. All right. We got a good hand, but let's see what the, they're, they're playing right now. Let's see what happens. Maxi opening hand is usually a very good thing, though. I have not seen Ash Blossom in a while, though, which sucks. That's it? Oh, son of a bitch. That's all you're going to do, huh? Okay, I got some good stuff. Kind of good stuff, I should say. I can't summon anything, so I'm going to do kitchen. And then link. Uh-oh, what's going to happen? What do you have? Okay. Okay. Um, anyways, other than that, I can't really do much other than Link.
Okay. Bam. Should I sphere now? I don't know if I should sphere now. Maybe it is a good idea to sphere now. I'm gonna do it. If I, if I didn't do it right, I'll pay the consequences later. Draw a card. Huh. Okay then. Alrighty. Doro. 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 Doro, 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 Doro. Is he playing? What the hell's going on here? Yeah, did he break that hard? I got two Phantasmes. Are you kidding me right now? This is pathetic. Well, at least I got... I can get stuff started now, at least. Unless he's got something back there. Finally, I have changeover. Uh, activation. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Bam. Oh, boy. Okay. Effect activation. Well, should I? Hold on. What do I have? I can just get it back like this. Oh, okay. Never mind. Just get it back like this. Then, uh... Why not? Get another one out here. Alright, he's got something there. I don't know what he's got. Only one way to find out. Only one way to find out, baby! Battle. What do we got? What do he got? What do he got? What do he got, baby? What do we have? What do he got? What do he got, baby? All right, here we go. Ready? Go. What do he got? Watch Mirror Force. Mirror Force. Uh. Huh? I'm so confused. He made it to silver. He made it to silver. Yay!